is up guys phoenix here and today we're going to be finishing up some more of the leone pixel art so if you remember where we last left off we did some of the top left side of the pixel art so um on the right hand camera screen he's kind of blocking right now let me see if i can scoot over oh no he's it's gone you see we have the top left done and i caught up the the blueprint with it because we had to use my finished product as a placeholder because i ran out of space on the left side but your left side should be looking something like this with a little bit more detail as you see at the top left there we have the white pieces in the hair and we're done with that side like i said in the last one so we're going to be doing more of the center and the inner face and the right side of her and this one around so what we're going to start first off is we're going to go to this part of her hair right here and i'm going to put a marker on it where we have the two vertical and you can see it on the right hand camera screen or right here it's like where the bang comes in in our hair we have two vertical followed by two single and we're going to go to the bottom block and the two vertical and use that to start it's going to the right of it we're going to put 32 dirt blocks so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten i'm gonna do three groups of ten and then um what do i mean and then two so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two. And after those 32 dirt blocks, we're going to just put one single black wool to start us off. And you can delete the dirt blocks from there. Or you can leave them. We'll just leave them for now. So from that one single, we're going to go up and to the left. Eight vertical pieces of black wool. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And from that eight vertical, we're going to start from the bottom and count up two blocks. So one, two. And from that block to the left and right side, we're going to put one single. So that's the nose. Now let's go and delete the dirt block. And we can start some of the mouth detail now. Whoops, I accidentally slipped. <laughs> now what we're going to do is we're going to drop down. So we're, we have right here the two vertical. We're going to drop down two this part of the pixel art where the neck and the hair meet up and it's like little triangle area right here and going up into the left from it you see we have the single two vertical one single and then the second single right here is what we want so i'm gonna put a block right there and zoom out so you can see it so right there is where we were just working with we're just coming down to the right from here to this single right here make sure you can locate it and to the right of the single we're gonna put 29 dirt blocks one two three four five six seven eight nine ten one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and then nine more one two three four five six seven eight nine so that's 29 and after that 29 dirt blocks what you're going to do is go to the right of it and put 12 flat pieces of black wool so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve and make sure you count it twice if you need to so just make sure it's 12 long and you can delete some of the dirt blocks now. I'm gonna make sure it's not touching it, but I'm not gonna delete it all yet. And now from that 12 flat, we're going to go up and to the right, five flat. So go to the box all the way on the end, or the block all the way on the end. Go up and to the right, five flat. One, two, three, four, five. Up and to the right, two flat. So we have 12, five, two. And from the right block and the two flat right here, we're gonna go above it and put three going to the right. One two three i'll just go and delete these extra dirt blocks now and the way i'm going to do this tutorial is i'm just going through each screenshot so i have like about seven screenshots and this is only the first one we're on right now so we have a whole bunch more to get through um we're going to do some more for a scarf and then we'll be done with screenshot number one so the way we're going to do the missing piece of the scarf now is we're going to grab some light gray wool let me mute my TV since it's picking up some of that clicking now, so of the menus. So what we're going to do is go to her lower left scarf right here, where we have these three singles, if you have this on your pixel art. We want that long block next to it right here. And we're going to count up 12 blocks from the base. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And as you can see on the right-hand camera screen, where I put the dirt blocks, that's where we're being at. So from the 12th block, we're going to put one light gray wool to the right of it. And that's where we're going to start. And then delete the dirt block so you just don't confuse yourself. And just remember, it's to the right of the 12th block. After that one single, we're going to go down and to the right. Five more singles. So it should be six in a row. One, two, three, four, five. 
like so. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, because I had one already there originally. Then we're gonna go down into the right, two flat, one, two, down into the right, one single, down to the right, a single again. And to finish this off, hopefully it touches the ground if you do this correctly, we're gonna go down into the right, two flat, three times in a row. So put your placement block, one, two, placement block, one, two, and then finally placement block, one, two. And if you touch the ground, you did it correctly. Everything down here is gonna be down to the left of it, it's gonna be light gray, and everything up and to the right of it is gonna be white. But we'll go over the colors later. So that's it for screeny number one. Screeny number two is gonna be working on the left eyeball. So let's fly up there. And actually there's a part of her bang that we need to finish too. So we'll do that as well. So first let's get to the bang because I'm probably gonna forget it. We're gonna go up to the center right here where we have this three vertical just hanging by itself. As you can see on the middle camera screen, I just put the three blocks right there. And let me just look around so you can see where it does. It's kind of up from the nose right here. All right. From that three vertical, what you want to do is we're going to just go up and finish it. So we're going to go up and to the left, three vertical, two more times. So placement block off the top block. One, two, three. Placement block off the top block again. One, two, three. And then we can delete those dirt blocks and just to see how it looks right now. From there, we're going to go up and to the left, four vertical, two times in a row. So placement block off the top block again. One, two, three. Four. Placement block again. One, two, three, four. And let's just keep deleting the door blocks. Keep your workspace clean. And now for the final touches right here, off the fourth block, I mean the second four vertical we have right here, we're going to go to the top block. And to the left of it, we're going to put seven going straight up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And as you can see, the first block is touching the last block right here, just to the left of it. And to finish this up, we're going to go from the seven vertical right here and go up and to the left, two vertical, one, two. And that's it for the bang. Pretty easy, pretty simple and straightforward. And we can start the more of the eye now. So first off for the eyebrow right here, we're going to go to the middle of it where we have the three flat dipped in. So this three flat right here, just always look at the right hand camera screen if you need to see where I'm working at. And from that three flat, we're gonna go down into the right, five flat. So placement block, one, two, three, four, five. Then we're gonna go down into the right, six flat. So put your placement block at the end again. One, two, three, four, five. And then the six block was already there, as you can see. So you should have this area right here, which is gonna be yellow. You can fill that in for the eyebrow later, or you don't have to do it now, it's okay. And then we'll start the next part, which is going to be a little bit of more of her like eye, like eye furrow, whatever you want to call it, before we start the eyeball. So going down to the right from here, we'll have that single right here, then three vertical. And from that three vertical, we want the two bottom blocks. So let's mark these two. Let me just zoom out so you can see once again. So from the bottom block, we're going to put one to the left and then delete the dirt block like so. And then this middle block that's still left, we're going to put 11 to the left. One two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 11. Perfect. Now we'll move on to the actual eyeball and it's going to be a lot of detail. So hopefully you guys are able to keep up. I'll go as slow as possible, but it's a lot of small numbers. So I think you guys will have no problem keeping up. But where we're going to start from is we're going to go down into the right from what we have right here and we're going to start from the two vertical we have just chilling right here so you see where i marked it you see it's underneath it's above the l we have right here and beneath the three vertical we have right here that's right after what we just built the two vertical we're going to start from the bottom block in that two vertical so top, knock away the top dirt block so from the bottom block we're going to put three to the left of it one two three we're then going to go up and to the left, four vertical, I mean four flat, sorry about that. I'm just laying out the foundation of the eye and it will drop down and do the circular part of it. So one, two, three, four. We'll go up and to the left again. So put your dirt block at the end every time. Three flat, one, two, three. 
Then we're at the top part of it. So put your dirt block again. We're going up and to the left 11 flat this time. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Let's just go back and delete the third block each time. Just keep your workspace clean and also a lot less frustration later on when you're trying to find what you've done. From the 11 flat right here, we're going to go to the last block on the left side and put one below it. Then we're going to go down into the left, four flat. One, two, three, four. Down into the left, two flat. One, two. Then we'll go down into left, two flat again. One, two. That should be touching the wall. And if you didn't have two flat, maybe you have, um, there might be like something like one block off where you're like this close, like one block away. Just put the black wool underneath and one to the left like that. But instead, I'll be going down to left, two flat like so. Maybe it'll be off by one block just because of the simple fact that um, I'm working off of a picture and not the actual blueprint, but it shouldn't matter. Okay. So now we'll continue and going back over to the right side of the eye that we started from. And we're going to go to the three flat that we started with over here. So the one, two, three. So find this three flat that you started this eye wall with. And we're going to go to the middle block in the three flat. And we'll go down below it. Three vertical. One, two, three down into the right so put your placement block at the bottom three vertical again one two three down into the right again so always put your placement block at the end of each block 11 vertical one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven i'm gonna recount that because i think i messed up one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven all right nope i did it correctly and just delete these extra dirt blocks now from that 11 vertical, put your placement block underneath it again, because we're going down into the left this time, not down into the right. But the dirt block still belongs in the same place. So down into the left, one single. Then below that one single, we're going to put an extra black wool, so it becomes two vertical now. Except from the bottom block, we're going to put one to the left and two to the right. And excuse me for a second, I'm just going to drink some water. It's going to take like, what, all of five seconds. Like, my voice is really dry, I just woke up. Drink water, kids. It keeps you hydrated. <laughs> Anyways, from the four flat right here, we're going to go and switch to our white wool. So go get that. Or snow. I think snow would be okay. Oh, God. I just got rid of everything. I'm bad. <laughs> so we're going to use snow. And we need our black wool again. All right. Let me swap the spaces around, too. Okay. So with the snow, we're going to go to the end of the four flat right here. And we're going to up and to the right. Five vertical. One two three four five i really think it's white wool guys um don't quote me on it i'm pretty sure it's white wool so i think the only thing is snow is the sheen in her hair so you might want to use white wool from the five vertical we're gonna go up into the right four vertical one two three four then finally up into the right two vertical and that's that for the this eye segment right here you can color this part in with white, but we'll go over it later. Just keep this all sectioned off and drop back down now to the four flat we have right here in black wool. So the four flat is going to connect with the rest of the eye later, but we're going to hover back up now. So follow all the way back up to where we have the three flat right here. We're going to up into the left from it, four flat, then up into the left, three flat again. And the three flat right here is what we want. So put your marker on it and you can see it on the right hand camera screen now. It's right before the 11 flat. So from the three flat, we're going to go to the block all the way on the left and go down into the left, two vertical pieces of black wool. So one, two. So whoops, let me show you how it looks. So as you can see, the two verticals touching it at a diagonal is not touching it directly. And that's what we're going to use to continue the rest of the eye. So from the two vertical, we're going to go to the bottom block right here and put two extra to the right of it. One, two. And now it becomes three flat and we're going to work with each side of it. So with the right side, we're going to bring it around to the left side because it's part of like the eye shape. So we're going to go down into the right, two vertical, one, two, down into the right, three vertical, one, two, three, down into the left, one single, 
down onto the left, three flat. One, two, three. And just remember, I always say this, put your placement block at the end of each one, just to continue. Up into the left, one single. Up into the left, four vertical now. One, two, three, four. And just to continue this, um, complete this circle, not continue this circle, we're gonna up into the right, one single, like so. And as you can see, it got all the way around and met where it was at. All right. Now from that four vertical right there, we're gonna go down to the left, six vertical. One, two, three, four, five, six. From that six vertical, we're gonna go down into the right, put your placement block on the bottom, three vertical. One, two, three. We're then gonna go down into the right, two vertical, two times in a row. So put your placement block at the end of each time. One, two, placement block, one, two. So that's two times in a row, and I'll just go back and clean up my workspace. And you can see the eyeballs are gonna be shaped out properly, which is really good. From these two, two verticals, we're gonna go down into the right, one single. And from that one single, we're gonna put one block below it, so it becomes two vertical. And then kind of like what we did over there, we're gonna put one block to the left of that bottom piece. And then we're gonna keep putting blocks over until it meets here at a diagonal, and I'll tell you how much it should be. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven blocks. So we put seven blocks to the right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yep. And it should touch at a diagonal, which completes the eye shape. <laughs> then we're gonna whip out the snow again. So switch over to your snow or white wool. And from this block right here, just hanging one single on the left side, we're gonna go up and to the left, one single. Actually, do I wanna do this part yet? Or do I wanna complete the other eye part? Hmm. I think I I'll do this part. So we're gonna go up and to the left, one single, like so, to start off this part of the eye, like the eye color. Then we're gonna go up and to the left, one, two, three, four, five more white walls from here. So put your placement block at the end of each one, and we're gonna do it five more times. One, two, three, four, five. And I think it should be six long now. One, two, three, four, five, six, yeah. And let's delete those dirt blocks. And I think they got covered in snow when you put them underneath. That's pretty cool. Then above the six block now, we're gonna put one black wall. We're then gonna go up and to the left, three vertical pieces of black wool. One, two, three. Up and to the left, two vertical, four times in a row. So one, two, just like that. And we'll do that four times. So this is one, two, three, four. From that final two vertical, we're gonna go up and to the left, one single. Up and to the left, three flat. One, two, and it met up with what we already had right here. And if you want to, you can actually go ahead and, I mean, we can just leave it. There's nothing wrong with it. The eyes matter properly. So let's go and delete these dirt blocks. So now what's left is the inner part of her eye. And then we can move on to the next part. So going below, hmm, where do we want to work from? Going below the circle we have right here. So we're going to go down into the left. So we have the six vertical right here then the three vertical. We're gonna mark the three vertical right here and use that to continue. So from the three vertical, we're gonna put an extra two black on top of it. One, two. And then from those two verticals we just placed, the top block, we're gonna put two dark rays to the right, like so. And actually, let's grab some yellow wool. And to the bottom right, the bottom block, we're gonna put two yellows to the right like this. From the two flat dark rays, we're gonna go up and to the right, three flat. One, two, three. Down to the right, one single. Then we're gonna mirror what we did up here with some yellow wool, so one, two, three, and then one, just like that. Then switch over to your black wool again. So where you have the yellow and gray right here, we're gonna put one black to the right of each of them and extend it up two extra. One, two. From the four vertical right there, we're gonna up and to the right, one single. 
down to the right three vertical one two three down into the right one single down into the left one single then up into the left one single and your eyeball should look like this right now and you can fill in these colors with black wool so we'll just fill in this one these three and now to finish up the right side over here we're gonna go to this one single on the right side we're gonna go up into the right one yellow and down into the right one yellow so everything above that yellow is going to be dark gray and everything below it is going to be yellow so i'm just going to outline it for you like so okay so everything up here would be dark gray then white then down here is yellow and that's it for the left eye we're gonna i would color it in but i feel like that's a waste of time we can continue and do it other sides so that's it for i think slide number two in my my screenshots actually let's do some of the right side of the eye from this slide as well so on the right eye, we already have some of her eyebrow done, but we also have some of this part dangling off. So go over to your right side of your pixel art. Okay, so you should be over here now. Or you, or me waiting did nothing. <laughs> so from this plank right here, let me just mark it. You should have this plank waiting from last time. And also you should have one single placed on this plank from last time. So from that plank, we're going to go up and to the right and hopefully meet up with what we have up there. So we're going to go up and to the right one single up and to the right two flat up and to the right two single one two up and to the right two flat one two and it did touch hopefully yours did too and then we can delete these dirt blocks that we have just because we know they're touching now and what you're going to do next is where we have the two flat right here, we're going to go down into the left to the second single. So I'm going to put a marker on it so you can see which one. We're going to go up into the left from that second single, three flat. One, two, three. All right, now from this entire like structure thing or eyebrow, we're going to go down into the right two singles. Then down to the right two flat so these two right here so this is where we're working from right now i think i've zoomed out enough that you can see where i'm at and from that two flat we're going to go down into the left two flat again so and we're doing a lot of diagonal stuff now so just put at the end of each time i tell you to put something just put a placement block so two flat first placement block like i said down to left three flat three times in a row so one two three placement block one two three placement block one two three so that's three times in a row let me just zoom out and show you it so we have two three 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 then we're gonna go down to the left two flat and now going back up to that last three flat right here we're gonna go to the third block on the right so this one and put two black wool underneath it one two from there we're gonna go down to the left three single one two three so it looks like this and now going up into the right so not going down to the left now so going back up to here we're gonna go up into the right one single up into the right three flat one two three and from the, hmm, where do we want to work with, actually? Actually, yeah, that's good. So with three flats, should have this one place space gap above it. We're just going to put one above it so it looks like this. And you see this one block we just placed in became, uh, it goes underneath the first block in this three flat. The second block in this three flat, we're going to ignore it. So ignore that and put a space underneath it. The third block, however, is going to get one below it. So it looks like this. Going back over here, you see there's a hole right here. You can fill that in if you want. Um, figure people get confused if it doesn't get filled in. But we're going to go back to this one single we just put below. From this one single, we're going to put one to the right. 
We're then going to go down into the right from this two flat that we just created two vertical. So placement block one, two. Put your placement block at the bottom of each structure now. Down to the left, four vertical. One, two, three, four. Down to the left, seven vertical. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And there is some more of that white, like, eyeball stuff that we're going to do later. So there's some space over here that needs to get filled in. So don't fill in the skin yet on this side. But anyways, from the seven vertical right here. We're going to go down and to the right. So put your placement block on the bottom. Four vertical. One, two, three, four. Down and to the right. Two vertical. And from the bottom block in the two vertical, we're going to put 11 to the right of it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And now we're going to go to the final block in the 11 to the right we just placed. So this final block right here and put an extra two above it, which should connect with what you've had from the last pixel art part, which it did. And then from the same block that we just put two above, we're going to go down into the right and put one single. Like so. So we have two above it, one to the down into the right of it and 11 to the left of it. Now going back up to the seven vertical black walls we have on the left side of the eye. So right here, let me put a marker on it. We're going to go to the top block, put two black walls to the right of it. One, two. Then from the second block on the right, right here. So that one, we're going to put one below it. So now this looks like this shape. And we're going to do the circular thing we did on the other eye, like just a tiny circle that's floating in the middle of it with this. So from this two vertical, we're going to go down into the right three flat. One, two, three. Up into the right one single. Up into the right four vertical. One, two, three, four. Up into the left now. So put your placement block on the top of it or at its bottom left side. Up into the left two single. One two then up into the left two flat one two so that's the circle we need in the center right there you can go and delete all these dirt blocks now because they're just in the way so just clear up your workspace again <laughs> and also let me see what else we have to do here because i don't want to miss a lot of the detail um what we're going to do is at the top part where we just completed the eye with that two flat so this two blocks right here we're going to go up and to the right from it, two flat, one, two, which as you can see, it can met up with what we had over here and created like a four long block. We need that to separate the eyeball from the rest of her eyebrow. So this top space right here is going to be black for the eyebrow. So let's fill that in. And below it is going to be eyeball. So this space right here needs to be separate because it's going to be gray and yellow. If you remember that. Now for, I think this is the final part of this slide, of slide number two. And even though I have seven slides, some of them only have like two minutes worth of content, where this one, as you can see, has about 28 minutes in so far. So from the, um, the four vertical we have in the circle of the eye, so the circle of the eye, the four vertical over here, I'm going to put a marker on it real quick. One, two, three, four. We're going to go to the bottom block in the four vertical and put one to the right of it. Like so. We're then going to go down into the right from this block that we just placed. Six vertical. So put your placement block here. One, two, three, four, five, six. From the top block into six vertical, we're going to go to the right of it. One dark gray, like so. And beneath it, we're going to put one yellow. Then from this dark gray, we're going to up into the right, one single. Down and to the right from it, two vertical. Down and to the right, three vertical. One, two, three. And then underneath each dark gray, we're going to put a yellow. So one down here, one down here. And just surround it completely so you guys can see where the yellow and gray separate. So you should have something that looks like this. So everything above here now is going to be dark gray, and everything below here is going to be yellow. But let's complete more of the eyeball. So going back to the six vertical black wall we have right here. 
we're gonna go down to the left one single so put your placement block up into the left now so put your placement block again two vertical one two up into the left again two vertical one two as you can see it met up what we already had at a diagonal which is good because you can fill in this entire thing with black now so fill it in just look at the right screen to see what's getting filled in <laughs> now all you need to do now is underneath the three flat so in this eye circle thing again the three flat we have on the bottom right here Starting from the right side, underneath that first block, we're going to put a dark gray. Then going to the left of it, we're going to put a yellow. Going to the left of that yellow, we're going to put two flat dark grays. One, two. Then down to the left, one single dark gray. This top corner right here, these four blocks are going to be dark gray, so fill that in real quick. And you can delete these three dirt blocks. And now you can see where everything is going to be. This is going to be white wool. This is going to be dark gray. And everything down here is going to be yellow. And I'm going to kind of outline it for you guys so you guys can see the yellow separation. There we go. So that's more of the detail for eye number two, or numero two, however you want to pronounce it. Let me see slide number three. What do we have on slide number three waiting? Oh, more details for eye number two. So we'll do that right now. So for that, what we're going to do is go down, back out right now where you see what I'm looking at right here, this part of the eye, and I'm going to put a marker on it, the two vertical part at the bottom. So you just put a marker on it so you guys can see where we're working from. We're going to go to the top block and switch to our snow and put two to the left of it. One, two. We're then going to go up and to the left, three vertical. So put a dirt block, one, two, three. And we're going to keep going up in the left, so just put a dirt block to the left or the top of whatever we finish. So we're going to up into the left next. Six vertical. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I put the dirt block again. Up into the left, seven vertical. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And that's it for the left side of the eyeball thingy right there. So you can actually color that in now. You guys can color in a lot of stuff. But there's still more on the right side. So we're going to go to slide number four now. So we're at number four of seven. So we're going pretty good. So we're going to go to the bottom right of the eye where we have this one single over here. And we're going to the right of it and put one black wall. Then above that, we're going to put a single. So it looks like a backwards L made of three blocks. We're then going to go up and to the right. Four single snows. So one, two, three four as you can see it touched down with whatever we had waiting for it already and you can fill in this area with white wool so we're on slide number four and let me see we have a lot more stuff to finish up hmm but i will cover that in another part so hopefully you guys did enjoy this tutorial this is phoenix and as always i'll see you guys later bye